Hey guys, how you doing? Right here again. If you'd like to subscribe, it's Nitro Kyosho. Uh, well, guys, it's been a while since I've been on uh, the camera here. Uh, summer is coming to an end. It it is to an end. <laughs> It'd be nice that it, if it wasn't, but we're uh, heading into uh, winter. It's not officially winter yet here in New England, uh, but it is getting very cold and very windy. Um, so the flying is going to be coming to an end probably the next week or so. Uh, but anyways, it's good to be back in front of the camera. Uh, and I got a new product here. Um, Zeo Blades, which I'm going to try uh, on this Dominator uh, 450L. Now I had a buddy that was running 350, these are 350 millimeter blades guys, uh, opposed to the ones that came on it that were the 360. Uh, and my buddy had a crash with his and he couldn't get the aligned ones at the time because the helicopter was still fairly new. And he bought another brand, I'm not sure which, but they were smaller, they were about 350 millimeter. He said the same as these. Uh, and he said that he thought the helicopter flew a lot better. So I decided to try these. I picked up a set and first impression, uh, it comes in a very nice wooden box. Which I'll show you up close in a minute. And it looks like this just slides out. Pretty cool packaging. It's like a hard plastic. And then the blades are in here. It looks like it has some spacers like uh, some other blades in the past have come with in case you need them depending on the type of helicopter. And let's get them out of there. And uh, very nice packaging guys that's the first thing that comes to mind uh, nice case here like a little velour on the bottom of it um, they look really nice it looks like it's going to kind of match the helicopter too and let's see if we can get them out of here and let's see Open looks like we can get these to come down and out. This right here. Very nicely packaged. Has the little pieces of clear plastic so the blades don't get scratched. Uh, the paint design looks real nice. I'll get up and show these to you. Okay, and these, like I said, are made by a new company called Zeal. They definitely come packaged really nice. That's for sure. Okay. And this is the box they came in, guys. Very nicely. They come in green in that pattern with the green and the white and the black or red. I got the red to match this. Uh, but very, very well packaged, guys, I'll say that. I mean, I've never seen a set of blades come uh, packaged like this before. They definitely don't want these things to get broken um, in the shipping. <laughs> but uh, kind of cool. Uh, I got these at Healy Direct uh, in Malden, Mass, uh, www.healydirect.com. Probably see this giant banner that I bought. I'm going to try to clean up this wall a little bit over the winter time, guys, in back of me, and I'm going to try to get some companies that have some banners to kind of spruce up this wall because somebody painted this one particular wall in our cellar a light blue and put rainbows on it. So if we can cover that up until we can uh, get around to painting it, it'll make it look a lot better. So thanks to Healy Direct for this giant banner here. Uh, and like I said, they're out mold and mass, uh, primarily all helicopter stuff they're selling. Uh, and uh, thanks to them. Uh, they were one of the few companies I could find that had these blades. So I don't know if any other companies out there are selling them or if Zeal has their own website, but I'm sure they do. Uh, but that was the closest place to me I could find them at. Um, and the other thing I'm going to do is these blades... Uh, they're 68 millimeters, guys, that come on the tail. 
And a lot of guys have been telling me you get better tail authority with this helicopter with smaller blades. So I'm actually going to put a set of the old 450 Pro blades on there that are 61 millimeter opposed to 68. Uh, so that's another thing that I would like, I'm going to definitely do before I fly this again. But <clears throat> hopefully we can get a flight video, guys, out. I don't know about this weekend because... They're expecting 40 mile an hour gust winds tomorrow, and uh, these little helicopters don't handle 40 mile an hour is that great. So we might have to wait till next week, uh, next weekend, or maybe in, during the week. Uh, but I would definitely, along with showing you these, like to do a flight video and then, you know, tell you during that video how I feel. Uh, they handled and they performed. Uh, that way we don't have to make a flight review. You know, we could do it all at once. Uh, but uh, I'm hoping it, it'll make an impact on how this thing handles. Uh, my buddy said it makes it a lot, uh, a lot more snappy. He thinks that the, the smaller blades, it handles better and uh, flies better. So we'll find out. Uh, and like I said, I'm going to put... I've yeah, got an order another set of these from Healy Direct, uh, a smaller set, and I'm going to try that also. Uh, but uh, anyways, guys, I won't hold you up any longer. Uh, like I said, Zeo Blades, we're going to give them a shot. We're going to see how they do, and uh, we'll definitely get a flight out there for you and, um, and a review after the flight. Uh, and uh, hopefully these blades... Uh, handle pretty good and maybe change the dynamic of this thing because I do love the the T-Rex 450L Dominator. It's one of my favorite helicopters. I practice with it more than anything. Uh, so anything you can do to improve it a little bit here or there. Um, the body kit, uh, this also came from Healy Direct. Somebody was asking me uh, where this came from and I never got back to them. I apologize. I get a lot of people asking me a lot of questions, guys, and sometimes you can't answer all of the emails. Uh, but uh, somebody was asking me, and that's where that came from, too. And that body kit, guys, I haven't even got a flight done with that because, like I said, the weather's getting kind of funny here in New England. But the body kit uh, does change the dynamics, the handling a little bit. It's, it makes the helicopter a little heavier, and it definitely gets pushed a little bit more in the wind because of the, the bigger boom on there. But as far as the visibility, it's incredible. Uh, it's worth the money. It, it changes this helicopter. You know, at one point I almost got rid of it because I fly Big Ear 3D, and I was having trouble seeing it. But this brings it back into uh, being able to visually see it. Uh, and definitely an awesome thing to put on this helicopter. I mean, it makes it look awesome, and you can see this thing from way out, and you can start doing, I can start doing stunts again that I was a little leery of because of uh, wondering which direction it was turned. Um, but that's kind of a, a cool thing. So uh, one of the reasons, guys, I don't like to put in my videos like WW, I was putting in www.rc uh, galore or WW Healy Direct. A lot of times I don't like to put that in there because guys will accuse me of owning the company and, you know, do you work for the company? And it's like, no, I just, I want you guys to know where the thing came from so you can, uh, if you want to buy one or you want to find it. Uh, but I'm going to start putting those little captions back in where these things come from guys because I'm not the owner of these companies so uh, and people want to know it's not uh, it's not fair to put show you something and then not tell you where it came from so I have to tell you where it came from guys <laughs> or the video is kind of useless so uh, I don't own these companies for anybody who wants to know I'm in the aerospace industry I, I fix jet engine parts for a living guys not RC helicopters <laughs> so as far as that hopefully nobody will accuse me of owning any of these companies although I wish I did uh, but uh, anyways that's it guys for this video look for the next one of uh, a flight and a, and a flight review of these and uh, Hopefully, uh, like I said, they change the dynamic of the helicopter, and uh, if they're pretty good, I'll definitely let you know. 
Thanks for watching, guys. Also, if you want to follow me on Facebook, type in Nitro Kyosho, all one word, and you will come to my community page. Thanks for watching.